Hello and welcome to Physical Wellbeing One. This is ES 101, the activity and wellness class for Truett McConnell College. This is the spring 2016 semester and you will be receiving the lectures on demand through the online classroom this semester for this course. My name is Dr. Robert Bowen. Uh, I can be reached at rbowen at truett.edu or in Miller 205 or at extension 235 if you call from an on-campus phone. This semester is going to be a little bit different because of the online hybrid format of this course. Um, so you feel free to use my office hours as frequently and as often as you need to. Uh, Mondays 10 a.m. to 12 p.m., Wednesdays 4 to 5 p.m., and on Thursdays 11 to 1 p.m., 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Uh, so all of the lecture material is online. However, you still are expected to meet for your activities, whether it's fitness, walking, with Mike Crowley or jogging with John Ye, uh, you will need to be ready to go for those activity classes to participate in those portions of the course. You're going to receive about 50% of your final grade for participation uh, in these activities. For the lecture portion of the course, you're going to be receiving lecture material and we're going to talk about a variety of different things from a healthy lifestyle all the way through fitness planning and nutrition. Uh, there's a total of eight lectures including today's lecture and then you have a total of 13 labs that you're going to have to complete and these labs are available in the uh, textbook for the course. So you need to pick up the textbook for the course. It's the 2015 Fit and Well Core Concepts and Labs in Physical Fitness and Wellness. It's in the 11th edition. It's available from McGraw-Hill and you can get it through the TMC uh, bookstore. These labs are going to be 15 points a piece unless otherwise noted. Um, lab 2.1 is actually going to be worth 20 points so that gives you a total of 200 points. I also have a schedule down here just to show you real quick. This schedule shows the topic uh, what you should be reading out of the textbook, the topic for the lecture material, and then most importantly the lab assignments, which labs you should be completing and when they're going to be due. So your first upcoming lab assignments are going to be labs 1.1 and lab 1.2 which will be due on January 27, 2016. These are Wednesdays uh, for each of these due dates and they're always due on or before noon so make sure you get them done and turn them in. I'll take them early but I will not accept late work. In addition there's a note here on the syllabus that I just want to take a moment to, to notice. Uh, it says all lab assignments should be turned into Dr. Bowen and Miller 205 on the due date specified in the course schedule. These assignments uh, request some personal information. If you are uncomfortable providing any information, black out your answers on the lab and note the question with I am uncomfortable providing this personal information. This is totally fine. I'm, I'm completely fine with you um, indicating that you don't want to share that personal information. I just want to know that you're actually considering it and you're, and you're thinking about some of this stuff. This is primarily for your benefit, but you do need to provide evidence that you considered all assigned questions and fully complete each laboratory exercise. By the end of the semester, the idea is that you're going to walk away with a better understanding of how to maintain and how to acquire a healthy lifestyle. And it's very important that you collect this metric data on yourself uh, in order to make these um, decisions to make informed decisions about your health and your wellness as we move forward. One last thing to note here, um, May 4th is dead day. On dead day, on or before dead day, uh, I would like to have your final assignment, lab 8.3, uh, turned in. So by noon on dead day, if uh, you don't get it in before then, then um, it's not going to be accepted. I don't accept any late work. Uh, also note that there is no final exam for this class, so the expectation is that you participate in your activities classes and do everything that is required of you by the, the instructors for those activity classes and that you are also reviewing the videos and completing the laboratory exercises. Now if you have any questions this semester, again, feel free to, to call me, to email me. Uh, or to stop by my office hours. I know that this is a little bit different because it is a hybrid class, uh, so I am going to be available for any uh, outside uh, conversations or, or out-of-class conversations that you might need. All right, so that's everything I want to say on the syllabus. You're going to have a copy of the syllabus. You're going to be able to acquire this, uh, so if you have any questions, you can reference this. Uh, again, I'm always going to be available.